PC. Today's video is an idea that I got from watching Uncle Willie's number 26 video where he was giving his first impressions of Uno and it had Latakia and Parikh and his experience was different than what the tin said. So that gave me an idea to do a battle of the tobaccos. So we're going to do a Latakia versus Perique 50-50. So I've had these out drying. And what I'm going to smoke them in are the best thing I can come up with to a neutral pipe or neutral pipes. I'll do two different ones. I'm going to do a clay pipe. And I'm going to do the butt of steel. Both of these should have no ghosting of other tobaccos in them. One, because I've never smoked anything in this one. And the butt of steel washes clean after each smoke. So what I'm going to do now, I've had the tobacco drying. I'm going to load up the pipes. Or first, I'm going to mix this all together here. I've got two cameras running. So, just kind of blend it all up. And then I'll see if one is stronger than the other or if it just kind of all blends together. Okay, I'm going to load up the pipes. I'll be back after I load the pipes and do the char lights on both of them. Okay, the char lights are done. So we'll start with the butt of steel first because I know how this pipe performs. And we'll see which one is stronger. Although I have an idea, but we'll smoke the bowl and see. And again, this is 100% pure. Louisiana Perique and 100% pure Cypress Latakia. hands down out of this pipe perique um, I almost can't even detect <laughs> the letter key at all the perique has completely completely overwhelmed it Maybe a wee hint of Latakia, but to be honest, I'm thinking it's just mostly Perique at this point. Mm. 
very strong smoke. This will this will wake you up in the mornings. And it's actually not bad. It's not. Um, it's not bad. An all day smoke. This is not. But the, the strength of this, I'd equate to my first experience of trying Peterson Nightcap. Yeah, that pre just completely knocked out Latakia round one with the job pipe. And I'm, I'm guessing if I smoke this all the way to the bottom of the bowl, it's going to be the same. It has not changed from the char light until now. Yeah. Definitely Preak takes round one in this job pipe. So we'll move on to round two. And final round, clay pipe, same exact blend, I mean, now maybe the Latakia adds something to it, which is why I could probably smoke this again from time to time if I just wanted a real, a real kicker tobacco. But I don't remember thinking that I could just smoke the pure Perique or the pure Latakia by itself. It wasn't like the Burley, but these two mixed together, it's actually not bad. Well, this, you can tell how fragile these little clay pipes are, but I'm, I'm glad I tried one. Couldn't find any overseas here. I had, uh, when I ordered my half and half from the States, I had them throw in a clay pipe. Yes. Round two and the fight. The winner is Perique, hands down, completely overpowering the Latakia. I mean, the Latakia showed up, but that's about it. It, it didn't, didn't really do anything. And I do have a noob palette, so maybe there's, and I, and I do concede that something changed that made me think that I could actually blend these in a 50-50 and smoke it on occasion. Where when I did the initial pure tests, I didn't get that impression that I would that I would smoke either one of those again just by itself. So,
And the winner is... Break. Definitely the champion here. So that wraps it up. Like I said, it was just an idea that came to me while I was watching Uncle Willie's first impression of Uno. I'll link his video down below since it was kind of the inspiration for this head-to-head uh, -head matchup. You know, that's it. I'm going to, I don't know, maybe smoke a little more of this and throw the leftovers in my catch-all and see what happens with that. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.